The Fountain Explained. Okay, so Hugh Jackman plays this scientist who's trying to cure brain cancer. That that's that's the actual story. He's c trying to cure brain cancer so that he can save his wife. His wife is writing this book about things that she's studied, and that's the Spanish conquistador part of the movie. That is him reenacting her book, writing about the meaning of life and like finding the tree of life and the fountain of youth, that kind of stuff. Now, Hugh Jackman, the doctor, is also Buddhist, and so he goes into these meditational uh, phases. Um, like at the very beginning of the movie, um, he's it opens with the conquistador and then it goes to him being the Buddhist in the tree bubble type thing um, but then he's sitting back at the desk and it flashes between him being Hugh Jackman the doctor with hair and Hugh Jackman the Buddhist without hair and that him as the Buddhist that's while he's in meditation and that um, phase between is how it how did I explain this where he's dressed as the Buddhist in the doctor setting, that's when he's coming out of meditation. So, it, there's three parts of the movie, but the doctor, doctor scene, like saving, saving cancer, saving cancer, uh, destroying brain cancer, and like the thing with the monkey, all of that is the actual story. The Spanish story, like I said, is just the girl's book. It it explains why some of this is important and then the monk is him meditating and it's him internally figuring all of it out that's really all the fountain is it's pretty simple it's a little weird to get your mind around but that's that's all it is